Mr. Ancho. Mr. Ancho. Henry? Yes, father? Mr. Graham has been waiting for half an hour. And he has to be at Thrushcross Grange, my ten. Has he, father? Are you being impertinent, Henry? No, father. Where's Heathcliff? His horse went lame. And you let him walk? We didn't want to be late for our lessons. And you let him walk? When you bought us a horse each, he wanted the finest and he took it. If he's gone lame now, it's his own fault. Stable those colts and get your lesson. Wild like animals. Or perhaps the loss of their mother. Oh, no, that would have made no difference. Cathy was born mischievous and wayward. As for Hindley, spite and his jealousy are growing and growing until they pass control him. And I will not enjoy his jealousy. Uh, well, Hindley's of an age to go to college now. Is he? Oh, yes. Can you arrange that? If you wish it, Mr. Earnshaw. Josses with me. I don't like mine. If you don't, I'll tell your father you'll flog me three times this week. Throw it, and then I'll tell him how you'll say you'll throw me out of doors when he dies. Take care of the ten, lad. Goodbye, Master Hindley. You go now. Bye-bye. 